the top half was painted by Mick Jones and the bottom half was painted by Simon Barber. Um, Mick Jones was supposed to be here tonight to talk a bit about it, but he couldn't make it unfortunately. So um, I could talk a little bit about um, the subject matter. He, he was painting about the issues of Fitzrovia. So if you look at the top, you can see a crane and um, like intensive building, which was about the kind of speculative building at the time. Um, it was built, it was painted in 1980, um, commissioned by Camden Council um, because the scaffolding was already up on the building because they were refurbishing it. So they thought, why not go ahead and, and paint a mural? Um, so that's what they did. And if you look to the left, um, there's, a, there's a build that you can see some builders and they were the builders at, um, at the time who were kept getting in the way so they thought that they'd, they'd paint them and, and that one you can see that the, the, shun, the sun is shining out of his arse. <laughs> um, and the, the kind of um, vampire character is uh, Horace Cutler who was the leader of the GLC at the time um, and, he, and there's his sort of evil plans for the um, for the area. Um, if you look in the centre, there's a there's a figure in a purple shirt sitting on a chair. That's Dylan Thomas, um, who was uh, in, in the area, made it um, made it, gave it its bohemian reputation. And um, the, the the blue figure of the boy in the centre with the OM sign on his shirt, he's supposed to represent um, the future. So he's looking looking out to the future. Um, uh, and then there's an, an evil architect and there's some uh, receptionists with churning out kind of papers with public cuts and rent bills and um, yeah. other things so it still really really resonates today um, and then the lower half um, painted by Simon Barber is about the characters and and history of the area so there's the textile industry re represented on the left and Soho and this sort of seedy, seediness there and then if we look down at the bottom if you look through the graffiti at the bottom you'll see two two heads looking at each other one of them is my dad and one of them is my uncle yeah. and they used to work in this shop here in 1980 and they're painted into the mural and we're trying to restore it so that it can be brought back to life <laughs>